Hi, I am Valder Beebe. I am the host and the visionary of That Celebrity Interview. Bobby Light, thank you for joining me here live in Dallas, Texas on the Felder BB Show. How are you? Dallas, Texas. Yes, I'm loving, I'm loving Texas, by the way. Oh, you'd love the weather. I want my audience to know that Bobby Light, he's here to talk about love and hip-hop Miami. Now, Miami's got pretty good weather there also, too, now. Yes, we do. We have the palm trees, we have the waters, we have the beaches, the sun. But lately, it's been a little up and down. I don't know. It's chilly okay. one day, then it's co- it's it's warm the next. Okay. Well, let's talk about Love & Hip Hop Miami. You are returning for the new season. Tell us about what we're going to see. Well, yes, I am returning for season two. Thank God. <laughs> so um, what you'll be able to see on season two of Love & Hip Hop Miami is a lot of me. Me working on my album, you'll get to also experience what I'm dealing with when it comes down to my friendships and the drama that I have stumbled upon. I'm dealing with a lot of, you know, <clears throat> the hate, the love, a little bit of it all. And you're going to get to also witness the lives of other amazing hip hop pioneers and artists that are trying to just find their rise to fame. And with me, like I said, the drama, me working on my music more in depth with my life, and straight, full-on entertainment. So, I mean, you can't miss it. Okay. It's me. <laughs> okay. So you're offering yourself up. This is how I feel about people on reality shows. You, you're offering up your life for the world to see. How do you take criticism when it comes along? Because let me tell you, I read that every day on my website. Somebody got to post something on there about how they feel. How do you handle that criticism? Or do you get any criticism? Um, Sometimes I get criticized, but this is, let me just make it easier for you. Um, Let me ask you a question. When someone leaves a negative comment, can I take that negative comment and go pay my phone bill or my rent with it? No, right? So I kind of just don't care. (laughs) <laughs> I don't care. I don't I don't pay attention to the negativity and I rather focus on the love. So whenever I see positive comments, I rather just focus on that. Every now and then I'll clap back just because I have the time and I can, but ultimately I'm not affected by it. Sorry haters. That's good. That's that's, that's a very strong that's a very strong attitude to have and that's a strong part of your constitution. So I'm thinking you're ready for this fame that you've got. And that's kind of where I was getting. You're ready for this fame. Yeah, I've I've had to get I've had to get myself prepared, and if I wasn't, I I am now. Um, it's it's one of those things where you just have to have tough skin. Obviously, I think everyone says that. It sounds very cliche, but at the same time, you really do have to have tough skin and a purpose. Have a purpose, and as long as you stick to that purpose and you live in your purpose, everything will be a breeze. And you know, when it comes to fame, it's just being popular on a bigger scale. And I, I'm grateful for it because the more people that love and support me, you know, the more of an opportunity I have to go global when it comes to my music and people being able to stream my music, more streams. So I am grateful for the fame and I have adapted to it. So therefore, I've prepared myself, you know, for the quote unquote fame or what comes with fame. Yep. Well, there's a lot of fame to be had because from what I'm understanding, love and hip hop, the franchise itself is the biggest reality franchise so you've got a chance to intersect what are you what are you bringing to tv that we're going to see in your your music your fashion what are we going to see from you okay right yeah so loving hip-hop miami or loving hip-hop the franchise is the biggest yes it is the biggest reality tv franchise and being a part of it now with miami um like i said earlier it just gives me a platform now so with that platform, um, 
you will see more of my fashion, yes. And you will see a lot of my music and majority of it being my music just because that's what the show is really about and that's what I'm really all about. It's um, showcasing my craft and um, letting people, you know, know that I have music out now. And when it comes down to my fashion, I just do me. I just express myself. I wear what I want to wear and I don't care what anyone thinks about it or how they feel about it or, you know, I, I just, I, I like to express myself at all times, any given moment that I'm given, basically, I want to be able to express myself. So I do that through fashion, I do it through music, and I do it through my words and what I say, so. All right, so you got some other people you're hanging out with on these new up-and-coming stars on Love & Hip Hop. I want my audience to know Love & Hip Hop Miami is on VH1. When does it come on? When do we see this new season, Bobby Light? Well, the new season just recently aired about a week ago, but it comes on each and every Wednesday, 8 o'clock, 7 central, only on VH1, and you have to set those DVRs. If you haven't watched it yet, catch up on the first season. You can have a day to binge watch, binge, I'm sorry, binge watch, and just catch up on all the excitement, the heat, the drama with Love & Hip Hop Miami so that you're all geared up for season two so you know what's going on and it makes sense. All right, then. Do you, and this is my last question. Do you think you guys will ever, like, tour the country? Because people want to see you in different parts of the country. I would love to tour the country. And actually, that's, that's all in my, a part of my plans and destiny for the future. I eventually will be on a tour someday. But that's uh, interesting. I thought that would be an interesting thing, too, like a Love & Hip Hop tour. I would love that. Yeah. How awesome would that well, be? That would be awesome, and to meet you in person, I'm sure my audience would love that. Bobby Lights, thank you so much. We're going to follow you on VH1's Love & Hip Hop Miami. Thank you so much for having me. God bless. Happy New Year. Happy New Year, and thanks for being my guest on the Valder BB Show. It's been my pleasure. It was my honor. Thank you.